At Kroger, I got a box of salad rotini pasta and salad shells. They're not really for salad, they just say that on there. Um, I got a package of 96 four lean ground beef, um, a ribeye steak, which we have some in the freezer, but I didn't think to lay them out, so I just bought one for tonight. Um, I got a jar of the traditional prego, that's my favorite. Uh, these freezer pops were 36 pops for 50 cents. So I went ahead and got those, and I'm gonna give my kids a little treat this week on Friday if they can, you know, be good humans. Um, <laughs> or eat them all myself. Um, I got some mozzarella cheese, some sharp cheddar cheese, pepperoni, medium cheddar cheese, a loaf of bread, I forgot those words, um, <laughs> a bag of cheddar and sour cream chips, um, a, is that five or 10 pounds? I don't know, some pounds of potatoes, those are just the jumbo russet. Eight pounds, actually. Oh, it's eight weird. pounds. Yeah, five or ten. it is weird. Um, I got three lemons to put in lemon water because my allergies been acting up, and I think that will make me feel better. I got a thing of chocolate chip ice cream, a pack of butter, and then you can judge. It's fine. I got three of these, or not three. I got six of these crispy M and M bars. These are my favorite, and they were on sale, so I got six. No shame. And then I got a pack of these aluminum foil pans just because they're easy to deal with. At Walmart, I got a 12 pack of the Clear American White Grape. They, they usually put them in the packages like this on the very, very top shelf. And so it's easier for us to grab one of these down than to just, because I'm going to buy 12 anyway. I'm going to drink them. Um, so we bought one of those and we bought some sweetener for coffee. Kevin went to Aldi today and he got us these uh, new mug cakes. These are the Baker's Corner Single Serve Mug Delights. He got the confetti cake mix, the brownie mix, and the cinnamon coffee cake mix. And each box has four individual pouches. So that is 12 mug cakes right there. So we went to Walgreens and I bought some zingers. Someone had asked if we would review the raspberry zingers. Um, the only zingers that we have reviewed are sea salt caramel. So I bought all three of these. They had raspberry, they had uh, vanilla, and they had ice devil's food. At Target, we bought the Archer Farms. This is limited time only. We bought the apple cinnamon pretzels and the pumpkin spice pretzels. We also bought some trail mix. We bought the candy corn crunch, the savory mustard, the apple cinnamon pecan, the rustic pumpkin spice, and the maple cinnamon raisin. And we, of course, will re be reviewing all this. Also from Archer Farms is the pumpkin spice cream filled rolled wafers. These are like the um, Starbucks that we've tried in the past. Um, these are um, Archer Farms maple truffle butter cookies. These are the pumpkin cheesecake cream sandwich cookies. I don't remember if we tried those or not. I don't think we have. I'm not sure. Uh, these uh, are the Betty Crocker limited edition mug treats. This is the pumpkin spice cake. And then... Uh, the rest of this is frozen from Target. These are the Yasso frozen Greek yogurt. This is pumpkin cheesecake and pecan pie. And then I bought some Bantam bagels. This is pumpkin spice. It's limited edition. And then the Johnny Pops, um, we bought the gingerbread and cream. We bought the pumpkin spice and cream. And then Kevin wanted to try this one as well because it is only at Target. So he wanted to try this one too. It is strawberry chocolate and cream. Uh, then we bought some mochi. We bought the uh, pumpkin spice and the apple pie a la mode. Um, Kevin also bought a sweater for himself. This is the Goodfellow brand and it's really nice. It has buttons down the front and it has uh, pockets on the side. It's just a really nice heavy sweater. And then at Home Goods, um, they had some of the peanut butter, chocolate peanut butter coffee that I like, but um, the last few times I've had this flavor. I've just loved it. It's so sweet and delicious. This is the Harry and David Moose Munch Maple Vanilla. And you know I buy them at Home Goods whenever I can because they're only $6.99 for 18 cups. At Walmart, Kevin bought a three pound bag of Smarties uh, <laughs> because this is a good time of year to buy these because you can get such a big bag at a good price. And only 25 calories per, per 
thing. Yeah, per roll. So you can eat four rolls for 100 yeah. calories. It's an excellent a, night snack because it will last me forever. Yeah, it really is. Um, then we bought some 35 calorie bread. I bought the Nestle Toll House. These are new pumpkin spice flavored filled baking truffles. So they're filled with the pumpkin spice. So I'm going to make uh, the, probably the recipe on the back. We bought these uh, Great Value chocolate covered almond filled dates. And we found the fall apple cinnamon trail mix. So we'll do a review of those. Um, I bought two more boxes of these Lance Toasty. I love these. My favorite crackers, peanut butter crackers, used to be the Austin. And the Austin changed their cracker. So I went to these and I love them. They have so much salt on them. If you like a salty peanut butter cracker, these are wonderful. And then uh, Kevin needed a strong flashlight. We have a flashlight, but he feels like it's old. We feel like Guido may be able to see this better out back. So it was thirty-five dollars. But it's a good bright light, though. It's yeah. Perfect. So we'll see. Uh, we'll see how it works. And then I could not find just a cinnamon candle. I wanted just plain cinnamon, and they did not have anything that was just cinnamon. So I bought this uh, Glade um, apple cinnamon, and I think it was like 488 or something. I'm gonna try it out. We bought some ibuprofen, some bowls, uh, bought some Tide, and this was twenty dollars. So fortunately, I had two. Well, I had two dollars off. Yeah. Uh, but it, that's twenty dollars for those things. And then I bought some mouthwash. In the last haul that you saw, Kevin had bought some flashlights at Walmart. He actually returned that one because he didn't like it. Um, it wasn't as bright as what he wanted. So he had looked these this same brand up on um, Amazon, and he said that it was actually more expensive on Amazon. We found these at Tuesday morning, and it was $9.99. So he said it was cheaper to get them like this at Tuesday morning uh, than from Amazon. So he, I think he actually ordered some from Amazon, but he got these to have as extras. So also at Tuesday morning, um, I posted a picture of, of these Mrs. Fields. Uh, this one is the chocolate chip cookie cake. They also had two other cookie kits. I didn't get those. I just bought this one to try. Uh, we'll see if we like it. And then I found these, this is called Euro Cake. These are cookies, soft and chewy cookies. This is a uh, chocolate chip cookies, brownie cookies, and coconut cookies. And then these are uh, made in Hawaii. They are lava crisps. Island Lava, made in Hawaii. This is the um, Baker's Brittle with chocolate chunks, but they're called, they're lava. Okay. And then these are coconut crisps. And then these are the Kona Coffee crisps. And they're Oh Hawaii brand, baked in Hawaii. And then Kevin bought 12, 14. Kevin bought 14 cans of Belmont brand nuts. So I hope they're good. We're gonna review all 14 cans uh, for you. This is the, they're all artisan. Uh, this is the jalapeno and sea salt. This is zesty chili cheddar ranch. Um, dill pickle. Chipotle spiced butter toffee peanuts. This is an artisan mixers uh, bayou blend. This is habanero and sea salt, maple bourbon, bourbon butter toffee, uh, artisan butter toffee. This is artisan hickory smoked barbecue, uh, salt and vinegar. This is a spicy bar mix. This one is the sweet chili and sea salt. Two more. Uh, sriracha and sea salt and uh, smoking hot barbecue and those were $3.99 each so that was at Tuesday morning then at five below we saw these I've never I don't remember ever trying either one of these these are strawberry puffs and the trolley um, they're both trolley and the squ squiggles I just don't remember. They look like gummy worms, but they're called squiggles, and I just don't remember ever trying anything called squiggles. At Kroger, I was able to find the Brock's um, 
these are these are Kroger exclusive, the uh, Dragon's Teeth candy corn and the Mermaid fruity candy corn. And then Kevin bought these for Andrew, uh, pumpkins, because Andrew loves these, so do I, but we bought these for Andrew. At Kirkland's, they were having a 30% off sale, so this was, this blanket was originally um, $24.99. I got 30% off. It is a velveteen Berber throw, and it is extremely soft. I will not put this out now. I will wait until we get um, our Christmas stuff out, till we put the fall stuff up, but I'm gonna put that out for Christmas, but it's very soft. They had all kinds of patterns, really nice. At CVS, I bought the Brock's Mini Candy Corn and Bunch of Crunch. This is a, a combination. And then we found these open road snacks. Uh, these are all popcorns, and we've just never seen this brand before. We bought the Caramel Crunch, the Jalapeno Cheddar, the White Cheddar, and the Classic Butter. And then lastly, at Walmart, we found uh, these uh, Great Value Donuts. We bought the Old Fashioned Glazed the raspberry filled powder donuts and the chocolate uh, frosted donuts. We bought some ground nutmeg, some pumpkin. I finally found the Hostess Limited Edition donuts. This is the Fruity Fetty. I had given up, I had just taken them off my list because I didn't think I was gonna be able to find them and then we found them today. So finally after a month, uh, we bought some creamer, and I know a lot of you all have told me to buy our batteries at Costco, but we were at Walmart, so I got them there. We didn't go to uh, Costco.